hi my beautiful virgo welcome to my channel goddess of light 1111 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely virgo sun moon rising venus and jupiter thank you god thank you universe universal energies ancestors spirit guy archangels ascended masters please give my please give my lovely virgo a clear precise honest message for the highest good all right virgo if you are new to my channel don't forget to hit the like the subscribe button the notification bell below if you are returning subscribers welcome back i do appreciate each and every one of you that are supporting my channel i'm grateful and thankful i'm sending lots of love new beginning and prosperity your way energies are fluid this reading may or may not resonate with you if it's not resonate check out your other breath chart placement for more clarity take what resonate and leave the rest so my lovely virgo let's see what's going on for you guys mercury is in retrograde and today is eclipse trust in the universe i feel like there's a uh, there's something here that you guys need to trust to trust the universe let go and let god that's what i'm getting here don't take matter into your own hand that's what they say right now yeah strengthen and guidance so you know i'm getting in here you need to have strength you need to be courageous you need to be strong and hold back let the universe deal with the situation virgo So we have holy love, beautiful energy. So, you know, your spirit, angel, ancestors, the universe is all about you, comforting you, loving you. There should be a whole lot of light that is around you. That's to bring you peace. That's to bring you love. That's what I'm hearing. So, yes, your guardian angel is with you, is guided you um, at this time. So you are beautiful in and out, aqua. You know, you the enlightenment, you the humanitarian of the, you know, of this world. So you are here. Your guardian angel is protected. You they also are leading you, um, to healings. One more card, please, for. And you have to take a step back yeah remember what i say you know you need to hold back you need to have strength and courage exactly take a step back you know the your spirit your angels is telling you that you know what we will do deal with this person we will deal with this situation just let us you know take the lead here opportunity and change there's a huge opportunity you know that's coming for you guys and you know the universe is letting you know things is going to work out things for the better just looking at things in different perspective put your you know put yourself into the situation you know um to see how would you handle it so let them let go and let god that's what i'm hearing for you guys so let's see this person current energy virgo is dealing with spirit so we have four of cups we have four of cups so you guys might be dealing with a gemini that is at the distance from you and this person kind of felt some type of rejection but they're missing you they're loving you someone in here missing you loving on them that's the common energy this person is in someone here still love you virgo it could be a gemini you guys this person loves you they are thinking about you they're missing you and this person is waiting to come in and take actions towards you they're just waiting on an answer from you here but they kind of feel bored wherever this person is currently they kind of feel bored they're gonna feel like some type of abandonment because you can see here someone here there's other cops they don't want them they just want you that's what i'm getting here let's see what's this person intentions towards you so there's no clarification unless something negative uh come out of the readings and spirits say that i need to clarify if they don't say it so we have three of cups two of swords what did what they need you to know here three of cups two of swords it looked like this person they might be in a situation ship they're not feeling the person they are dealing with they are trying to make a decision between you and someone else mm. 
yeah there is a situation wherever this person here there was no giving and receiving this is done dead you know done, done 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 that's what i'm getting here so this person main focus is you like i said someone loves you they want giving and receiving with, with you they, they want reciprocity with you wherever they are the relationship is over let's see this person attention so it's your virgo So eight of swords, someone wants to come towards you guys. They feel like they have to be patient. That's what I'm getting here. Eight of swords, this person is in their head. They kind of uh, self-fulfilling here with, you know, feeling like they are trapped bound, you know, self-imprisonment here. Nine of wands, someone in here definitely want to come towards you, but they're waiting on divine timing. That's what I'm getting here with the wheel of fortune. They have this nine of wands here. This person is definitely fighting back to make their way back to you, but they feel like they have to wait. So what you guys need to know that you really don't have to worry about any past, you know, person here. I mean, in, when I say any past person, like if they're dealing with someone, the relationship is over. So they're just waiting on divine timing. They're just waiting on you to take action towards them. Let's see this person actions towards you. Someone could, this person could be dealing with, you know, this person action towards you. They, um, is that four of pentacles. Someone in here could be dealing with a Leo. I'm just going to telling you. Someone could be dealing with a Leo to be specific. Judgment. They are making some type of judgment call when it's come to you. They might be calling you soon. They might be, you know, going to take action towards you soon. But they do uh, feel like you and them are destined to be together here. But for, they might be holding back. If this person, let's just say this person is dealing with a Leo. They are going to hold back from this person. You know, I'm feeling here someone might be saving themselves for you you because the yeah, four of pentacles here they are saving themselves for you they're very attracted to you so they are they definitely because i'm i'm hearing it because i'm saving all my love for you so they are so that's what i'm hearing here hmm. let's see what they want to say to you virgo Yeah, someone in here, uh, what they want to say to you. This person want to telling you, I love you. I'm stable, I'm grounded, and I definitely, someone in here is ended, you know, they ended something. Uh, for some of you, this person might end it, their job, they might lose their job, they might lose their, uh, their money here. And, but we have Queen of Pentacles, but they see themselves as mari marriage material. Maybe you you tell this person that also, because I'm feeling here, even with the um, what they want to say to you, they could have been in a long-term relationship. They ended it because they, they love you. So they are ended. That's what they want to telling you here. Queen of Pentacles, they're ready for marriage. They're ready for long-term stability with you here. So, so we would say clarify judgment for you guys. And I'm going to do that in, in Eight of Swords. Let's clarify judgment, please. Yeah. <laughs> So this is someone, yeah, they are going to call you, literally. Someone in here, amen. You guys might be at this distance from this person. They're literally going to calling you and say, Virgo, guess what? I am free. I am single. I in a relationship. The cycle, it's over. It's ended. I'm coming home. So someone is calling, going to call you, letting you know that they are free and available. Yes, they are. <laughs> I know, didn't you? I know, right? So let's clarify Eight of Swords. Ooh. 
Well, there's too many. We ain't finished messing with that. That's who, who made it? Somebody could have been dealing with some uh, with someone that is very toxic. Someone that is manipulative. Someone that is toxic. Yeah, ten. You know. Yeah, yes. You know, wherever this person was, there is giving and receiving and stuff like that. But they could have been dealing with someone that is also very resistant. That is all about themselves. You know, ten of ones. It's they feel like this relationship is gonna a lot of work with the, with the seven of ones here because it's like, um, your person is giving, but they're not getting a lot of back because someone in here is fighting the connection. That's what I'm getting here. There is, you know, giving and receiving into a loving connection, but someone someone else is fighting the collection, no, fighting the connection here. So your person decided they're going to end this relationship. They're going to end, especially if they were in a family dynamic with the Ten of Pentacles in a long-term family relationship they're like mm -mm, i'm leaving this mess behind because i miss my virgo i love my virgo i want to come that's what they say here you know take a step back in different perspective let things flow naturally you don't have to work you don't have to do anything here this person will come to you let's see the divine timing um let's clarify the will and i'm done Wow, look at that. Okay, Virgo. So we have Nine of Cups. We have Nine of Cups, King of Cups. King of Pisces, Scorpio here. I feel like when, you know, divine timing here, you guys will be with your person. That's what I'm getting here. Your wish, your dream will be granted. You and this person are going to be to have your the happiness you have been uh, seeking here because someone is definitely ending a situation. Wow, I like it. Okay, I like it. <laughs> so you have nine of cups, king of cups. So we have Pisces, Cancer. You have we have Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and we also ha we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Not a lot of air. But I'm just going to say, you know, because we have two of swords. So I'm just going to say Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We don't have that many air here. Huh. Give me one card for the Queen of Pentacles. Say something. I just want to see. Ah. of pentacles is waiting yeah i look like the queen of pentacles yeah this person is waiting for a decision to be made here so the queen of pentacles might be waiting for a pisces or a leo but what i'm getting here queen of pentacles have a son there's there's charles involved here so they're waiting for a new beginning so okay so beautiful beautiful energy here for you guys virgo you're reading very positive hallelujah with that bye virgo i love you guys so you guys are about to get your wish you know with this person bye